Today I'm discussing the link between having a low thyroid function and perhaps you're medicated for this and your breast health. So what a lot of people don't realize, especially for someone who's taking thyroid hormone as a pharmaceutical, and maybe you've taken it for years, that this will make you increase the metabolic rate of the body and in turn increases your need for iodine. So for anybody who's been on a long-standing hormone replacement for thyroid, for low thyroid, hypothyroidism, this is a caution to you that your body will have that extra need for more iodine and iodine deficiency is very prevalent. So in a large part of the population, this isn't something that is often tested for, so you wouldn't necessarily know that you have an iodine deficiency, but the thyroid is very much reliant on having enough of this active iodine as well as the breast tissue. So iodine deficiency can lead to breast tenderness fibrocystic breast diseases, and there is a link between breast cancer and iodine deficiency as well that you should be aware of. So if you are taking something to support your thyroid gland and it's a pharmaceutical and you're giving your body that hormone, just be aware that you are also making sure that you are getting enough iodine every day. So I promise we'll share links in order how to further support your thyroid gland with some whole food iodine as well and making sure that you are staying healthy from top to bottom. So today I talked all about the thyroid and how that can be linked to your breast health. It's definitely in the research and I hope that you continue to do more research on your own from the things that you learn in my videos. If you do have questions or comments I'd love to hear from you please drop it in the comment section below. Be sure to share this video as well and give me a big thumbs up. If you're new to my channel welcome in. I hope that you'll subscribe and turn on your post notifications by clicking that bell. Everyone does have a calling in life and mine is to empower you to live a healthy lifestyle and of course to do it naturally. Thanks for watching.